here we can say that um, there was an abrupt turn from 0 0.7350 mark. Uh, New Zealand's dollar declined after the Reserve Bank of New Zealand killed hopes for a rate hike this year. The Bank of New Zealand's monetary policy statement noted that exchange rate remains higher than it is sustainable and that a depreciation of the New Zealand's dollar is needed to revive the country's economic growth. As a result, um, the currency slumped to the area of 0 0.7170 after the announcement and is now trading in this area. Uh, we can see that there is some support uh, located around 0 0.7175. 0 0.7115, but below this level, we'll target levels around uh, 0 0.7070. Uh, this is a 50 day moving average. So, uh, this is a really um, viable target for the New Zealand's dollar in this week. We can also use Fibonacci instrument in trading, take Fibonacci from December low to uh, February high. We can see that now the pair is supported by 38.2% Fibonacci retracement and uh, this way the main levels to focus on are located at 0.7117 and around 0 0.7060. Also, there is a big confluence of the moving averages around um, 0 0.7130, 0 0.71. They may provide some support for the pair, but all in all, these moving averages are horizontal, and the pair is uh, returning to these moving averages after it made it made the swing to the upside. Now it is returning lower and may even try to test levels below these moving averages. Resistance for the pair will be located in the area of 0 0.70 to 50. We'll watch data from the United States and uh, some figures from the New Zealand like uh, retail sales release. 